hope it's in focus. Maybe I should check one more time. Here's the thing about being gay. You want it to be normalized. You don't want it to be a big deal. I don't want it to be a big deal. I want I want it to be the same as everybody else. I don't want to have to come out. I don't want to have to tell people I'm gay. I don't want them to assume I'm straight. I want it to be Fucking normal. I'm not gay. Okay, listen Don't here. Don't tell me things I'm not. Stop being gay. I'm not gay. It's a choice. I'm so straight. It's a lifestyle choice. I choose choice, to be Martha. straight. You guys know where the gays are? Where are the gays? She's, where are the gays? she's pointing us. She's like, those are gay fuckers. Oh, I love her skirt. Oh, <gasps> she's following. <laughs> I feel so happy. I always felt like that. Where the gays? Where the gays? <laughs> and with that comes the struggle of it not being normal. Because even if you don't want to come out, sometimes you have to. You're forced to. And you feel like you've lost some sort of dignity because I pride myself on not coming out. Personally. I that's not something I want to do. And sometimes it's not gonna be normal. They got, head hey. they got headbands. <laughs> and there's gonna be less representation that you're gonna get to watch. And there's not gonna be poems about it as often as there is heterosexuality. And you're not gonna encounter as many gay people or LGBT people. It's not going to be as normal. It doesn't mean it's not normal. It's just not normal. I don't know. I am so proud of my sexuality. And if you asked me to name things about myself, saying I'm gay would probably be on the top of the list. And if you ask me to name things I'm proud of, being gay would be on the top of that list because I am so proud of being gay. And you know, people say, well, I'm straight and my sexuality isn't everything, so why is it everything to you? Because it has to be everything to me. Because if my sexuality isn't important to me and I am not proud of it, where will I ever get? If I'm not proud for myself and I don't go outside of the boundaries of coming out and doing these things, then it's never gonna, it's never gonna change. Nothing is ever gonna get better. Nothing is ever going to be more normalized if I am not screaming about it and knowing how proud I am and showing people how proud I am, they won't recognize it because they get to be proud. They don't even realize it. I am proud of it and I want people in the future, little kids, to be able to be proud of it and not worry about it. And I'm not saying me, my influence alone is going to do that, but... Yeah, I'm gonna fucking name it top on the fucking list because I have worked so hard to be proud of it and be in a place where I can go to Pride Day because it's not normal and we deserve to celebrate it. Celebrate our LGBT fucking cuteness. <laughs> it's not gonna be normal. And you know what? Sometimes you're gonna have to do things you don't wanna do. Sometimes it's gonna make you feel like you're not normal or it's the end of the world. But fucking who is normal? Straight people aren't normal. Nobody's normal, and if we continue doing things, this will be normal. It will be recognized as normal. And that's one of the things I pride myself most is, I said,
said normal a lot, but who doesn't want to be normal, you know? I think we're all pretty not normal, but that's besides the point. Oh my god! Hi! You're the hottest person I've ever seen in my life. What? Get out! No, I'm serious! No, I've met another one that's hotter. <laughs> How long did it take you to do your makeup? It takes about an hour and a half. Oh my god! Oh, good. I love that takes you like, I think I love you my regular makeup. Let me show you. Let me show you who looks better. Who looks better? Okay. Oh my god! Better. I love you so much! Why are you ever If you have ever felt insecure of yourself, or unsure of who you are, or upset with who you are and you don't like it i really hope you don't feel that way one day because no matter what no matter if your parents don't accept you or you were forced to come out or you don't want to come out or you're scared to or you don't know if you are a part of the community or want to be or anything just know that it's gonna be okay, you know? It's gonna be all right. And you have every reason to be proud of yourself. And we have every reason to scream how proud we are from the rooftops. Even if people say we shouldn't obsess over it that much, that's where and when we will get somewhere, is when we obsess over it. Because the more we fucking blare it in people's ears, the more they have to be acquainted with it. <laughs> and we should be proud. And we should be unbelievably grateful with how far we've come. But we have a lot, a lot more to go. And you should be loud and you should be proud and be respectful of other people. But be proud. unabashedly yourself. That's when progress will be made. So, happy Pride. Even though it's not Pride Month anymore, I'm fucking close. And happy Pride forever, because it's always Pride Month, because I'm always gay, so. Zoe! <laughs> <sighs> Don't be afraid to be who you are, even if who you are can seem scary. I'm gonna like float away. Are you happy? No, I am homophobic.